for On My Way to Work by Paul McCartney off the new album. Um, this is a complete quintessential Paul McCartney song to me at least. I love the chords, I love the vocals, um, and I really love singing Paul's older voice songs because they're easier for me to sing. So I just think it's a wonderful song, really excited to do this one. Um, let's get into the lesson. The guitar is in standard tuning, there's no capo. The song's in three basic parts, the structure. We have the verses, um, I'll call them the refrains and then that musical interlude part. So the, the verses and the refrains, I'm playing, you know, the rhythm chords very much like Paul plays. You can watch, he does do this one live on occasion. Uh, so you can watch it on YouTube and see him strumming the chords, which I'm going to show you. And then um, the third part, the musical interlude part, I, I've done some adaptation for that part just for acoustic guitar. So let's get into the lesson again. We're going to start with um, the verses. So it starts this way. On my way to work, I rode a big green bus. I could see everything from the upper deck. So it's a G to a C to an E minor. Hold the E minor. Back to C, back to G. And that's the verses. All the verses are the same, and that's it. Uh, so we'll move on to the second part. We're, we're going fast today. Um, the refrain, pretty simple, pretty straightforward as well. It starts with a C major. But all the time I thought of you. To an A minor. How far away the future seemed. To an F major. You hold that. How could I have so many dreams? Back to the A minor. And one of them not come true. Let's go through all that. Um, starts with a C. All the times I A minor. You would hold that. How far away the future to an F seemed. Hold the F. So back to A minor, and then it's a C, A, D to a D seven, and then let it ring. And then you're back 
five. That's the, the complete refrain. That's two parts of the song, and it goes straight back into the verses. So a G. On my way to work, I a magazine. Saw the pretty girl like the water ski. She came from Chichester to study history. She had removed her clothes for the likes of me. All right, so there's the musical interlude part, the third part of the song, the final part of the song. So we're getting there. Um, again, I've probably said this before. I'm a rhythm guitarist. I like playing chords, open chords, bar chords, doesn't matter. I like different rhythms, but I struggle with um, lead guitar parts or note parts. Um, so I try to make them as simple as possible. So this adaptation is for me, my, my guitar style on a lone acoustic guitar. I think when Paul plays this in concert, I don't even know if he's playing anything at this part or he might just be holding the one chord that I'm gonna suggest, which is an E minor chord. So throughout this little riff, um, I'm holding the E minor shape, and I would suggest you use your second and third fingers if you don't normally do it that way, because that will help with the riff. Um, so again, just an E minor shape, and actually an E minor chord, but you want to hold that throughout this entire riff. So the riff is in two basic parts. Um, it starts this way. So that's the two parts. The first part alone is just this. So that is basically, again, hold the E minor shape, open E, and then you go on to the second, um, I'm sorry, second fret, uh, fourth string, then open, fourth string, back. So let's hear it. Ah. <laughs> so it's open bottom, fourth string, on second fret, open, back second fret, and then open G. And then you're gonna hit the bass, back to the E. So let me try it one more time here. So this is the first part. So try to get that. It took me a little while just to get that smooth, and sometimes I'm still not smooth with it. Um, not very difficult, but it's just not the way I usually play my guitar. Um, and then the second part is just a variation on that. Uh, so let me play, let me play the first part and the second part because it really is all together. All right, so you can probably hear the difference. And if again, if you're noodling around, fingering with your E minor chord, you can probably just hear these notes. But um, so the first time, then the second time, same thing, except then on the third string, you can hold the second fret, and then. Um, third string, second fret, and then open. And then you're gonna add on the bass notes, you're gonna add the A first, then down to the G, back to the E minor. And that's the two little parts of the riff. So let me try it one more time. I can't do it too slow, I think I'll screw it up, so. song it actually ends with that so that's on my way to work by Paul McCartney off new again one of my favorite Paul songs I mean um, maybe not a masterpiece but really really a nice song just another hidden gem that's on another album that never gets played on the radio uh, but I like to sing this one I like to play this one so I hope you enjoyed the lesson thanks a lot for watching have a great day